This video is a tutorial for the Rotating Sky Explorer for the homework. First, navigate to the website for the simulator. The link is found in the homework description. Alternatively, search for Rotating Sky Explorer and then click on the link that includes astro.unl.edu. Your browser must allow for Flash Player. Now I will explain the display. On the left, you will see the Celestial Sphere view. In this view, the sky is assumed to be a sphere with the Earth rotating at its center. You can move this view by click, hold and dragging on the picture. Let's take a look at your location. You can select your location by either click, hold and dragging in the lower left map or by manually entering your location. As an example, I will choose the coordinates for Bulgaria's capital, Sofia located at 43 degrees north and 23 degrees east. On the right, you will see a perspective of a ground observer from this location. To aid further explanation, we shall start the animation. This can be made faster or slower using the scroll. We shall also set labels and disable the underside of the horizon diagram and add star patterns. On the left side of the diagram, now you will see the celestial sphere labeled with the northern celestial pole, the celestial equator, the southern celestial pole, as well as the locations of the three star patterns you have chosen, the Big Dipper, Orion, and the Southern Cross. On the right side of the diagram, you will see a representation of our observer, geographical north, south, east, west, the zenith, which is straight above the our, our observer, and the northern celestial pole, as well as the celestial equator. As the Earth turns, underneath the immovable sky and the faraway star patterns, the ground observer will see each of the star patterns circulate around the northern celestial pole, some of them never setting or rising, some of them rising and setting, and some of them never seen at all. You can also experiment with how the view changes by changing latitude and longitude. Observe how 
the view changes if we change latitude from north to south. Or if instead we change longitude from east to west. This concludes this tutorial.